Well, good morning. It's going to be another great day. And this series that I am now starting on the goodness of God can change your life. It's probably one of the most misunderstood truths in the Bible. A lot of people blame God for all the bad things that happen in their life. Well, they're not from God. Every act of God is an act of goodness. Every good gift and every perfect gift come from above, from the Father of lights, with whom there's no variableness or shadow of turning. I want to talk about God's goodness today as represented in His providence, as found in His providence. I looked up the word providence. Here's what it means. God directing the universe and affairs of men with love. Don't you like that? It's the care and guidance of God using the resources of the universe. Think about that. God has all the resources that you need. <laughs> First of all, He has the resources of heaven and earth. It's all His. His providence. You know, there's a story of Abraham. It's found in Genesis 22:13. Abraham lifted up his eyes and looked, and behold, behind him a ram was caught in the thicket by his horns. And Abraham went and took the ram and offered him up for a burnt offering. How come that ram was stuck in the brush? It was because God divinely planned that ram to be there for Abraham as a sacrifice. I remember one time I had a problem with my car. I was pulling into a driving spot and I wrecked the front bumper and the fender and when I got it repaired there was kind of a large space between the door and the fender and I was always upset that the mechanic never properly fixed it. But one day when I was getting out in the garage with my little daughter, she was sweet, she was just had started walking, she, I was getting some groceries out of the back seat of the car and she was walking to the front to go to the end of the garage into the house and she put her hand in that crease between the fender and the door. And I closed the garage or the door of the car, not realizing that her hand was there. And you know what happened? If that crease, that large crease, had not been between that fender and that door, it would have broken all her fingers. You say, well, did that accident, well, did God allow that accident so that space would be in that car? I believe he did. I was upset about the accident at the time, but I didn't realize later. It would be a place where my daughter would be saved from hurt and harm. You see, God is working in His providence in our life. Receive that love today. Enjoy Him. He has all the care of the universe available for you. His providence for your life. We breathe you in. We breathe. We breathe.